she's a very unique player. She does things where you don't tell her to do, she just knows to do them. She's not one to complain, she stays positive. Her team is really feeding off her energy. Right now, she's on the cusp of being a superstar. You can tell she uh, she wants to win. She's got the unique knack. Uh, very aggressive offensively. Defensively, she really helps us out tremendously because she's so long. Some kids don't have that willpower. She wants to give that extra effort. She's just very active. Hands are always up and moving, so she helps us a lot. She's just been a phenomenal piece to what we've been able to do this season. I'm motivated to win the whole thing. She's become more vocal and become more of a vocal leader. The way things flow when she's on the court, it's probably her best asset. is uh, one of the most versatile players that I've been around. She has such a versatile game and she's willing to play so many positions. And she's so versatile, she's able to play multiple positions. Joseph Grace, um, assistant coach here at Southwest Guilford High School. She has a great handle of the basketball, um, great post player. Um, Nick Scarborough, I'm the head coach of Southwest Guilford High School, women's basketball. She's playing in the post, she's playing on the wing, she's handled the point guard duties. My name is Christina Rizos, I'm an assistant basketball coach at Southwest Guilford. She's good about talking to her teammates, and encouraging them, making them better. As a dad, I'm just extremely proud. Um, I worked on getting to the cup more, creating my own offense, and shooting off the dribble. You can see that she's progressed because of her own willpower to be a better basketball player. And she'll be one of the best ones that have ever come out of here. From sophomore year to junior year, she's improved greatly. The game is slowing down for her, and she just kind of understands and has a better feel for things. And as her coach, I've seen her grow. Lauren has really grown in her leadership ability, especially this year. And that was one of her goals, was to get better in that area. And she really has. We just played as a team. Brendan Christman, the athletic director at Southwest. You know, she's such a competitor, um, and she's got such a drive. Pretty much all I did was go to the cup more and get in ones and all around just crack the boys. What I will tell you this, I woke up Sunday morning, I had a text message from her, and she said, uh, Coach, is there any way I can shoot in the gym today? I just want to practice a little bit. And I told her that she could come on over. We had church service going on here at school, and I think she came over and shot till about 1 o'clock that afternoon. Just because her drive and her motivation to get better is the type of personality that she has. Overall, the coaches have put me in better positions to score, running, get to the cup. Scored the ball really good, but also defended the ball well. So 
course, she goes to the YMCA when she has free time. And I think that speaks volumes of her and, and her character and, again, her ability to want to be the best basketball player she can be. Day by day improvements, um, showing that I've improved and um, going coast to coast. During that Sheets Holiday Tournament, I think she, she did it all. I mean, she, she scored, she defended, she rebounded. As a team, you know, we came in with a goal, and Lauren is a team player. She tries to get her whole team involved, and she came in with the mindset of helping her team, so she did what we needed her to do. So she just did it all in that tournament. A stat filler, uh, rebounds, assists, points. She was everything we needed her to be, and more. When I watch her play basketball, she's become a better outside player this year with her shooting ability. Lauren received the Most Valuable Player Award in the Sheets Holiday Classic Tournament by averaging more than 21 points and 8 rebounds per game. Needing 36 points to reach the 1,000-point mark for her career, Warren had an unbelievable performance against East Forsyth, scoring 40 points. Great basketball IQ. It's just been a joy to coach her and to see her transform over the past few years. She is really a joy to coach. some very good girls basketball players over the year here at Southwest, but to do it as a junior, well, I think it's unique. Lauren finished her junior season averaging 17 points and six rebounds per game. Overall, I want to say that I'm very pleased with how Lauren has performed in her junior campaign. I knew that it was something she always was capable of. She's more comfortable in the role of taking command, whether it be through action and attacking offensively. Her game has been out of this world so far. She does play all five positions. Uh, she can guard all five positions. I'm blessed to be able to hit my 1,000 points. Um, it's one of my goals that I've been trying to reach since the beginning of this year. I really enjoy um, working with and coaching Lauren. I'm very appreciative of my teammates who've get me involved in every game and we're starting to click together. Also, they had a lot to do with my 1,000 points. At this point now, she can score the ball very well, attacking off the dribble or knocking down jump shots. I think she also does a very good job of getting other teammates involved, and that has been the key to our success. Over the summer, I just want to bring the firepower I brought out of school ball, also getting back in the flow of things. <laughs>